apparently we're at a time in history when people are really into science. Like, I trust the science. Suddenly, did you know that you've been walking around in a suit made of science for your whole life? To me, it's very interesting how people are interpreting science depending on how in tune with their nature they are. So here's an example. These sunglasses block 100% of UVA and UVB light. I would say, oh, that's not good. You need to connect with UVA and UVB light. Our whole circadian rhythm is, is tied to that. Your, your eyeballs need to experience it so that you can sort of entrain and, and sync up with your circadian rhythms. Somebody who doesn't fully understand the beautiful science they're walking around in would say, oh good, I want to get those glasses because I want to block all the UVA and UVB. It's very bad for you. Interpretation of science really hinges on how much you trust this meat suit you're walking around in. Do you know what I mean? And how much you understand it. Next up, I want to introduce you to my zero waterproof hikers. This is a barefoot hiker. Did you know that your feet were designed to carry you and absorb all the shocks. They're designed perfectly. Then we, we strap on these huge fat sneakers and our dress shoes and we change the way our feet are shaped, change the way our feet work. Our feet forget how to absorb shock. Then we have to go to orthotics, thinking that solving the problem, like using the science of orthotics to solve the problem when actually your foot was designed perfectly <laughs> and just going back to barefoot is actually the solution. This is what I'm talking about. The solutions are really inside you a lot of the time. I would love to help you understand and just trust this thing you've been gifted a little more, if I could.